The AWS 924 channel strip continues and maintains the classic channel design of the original AWS 900 console. The input section features a choice of either a microphone preamplifier or line input. The mic pre is the classic SSL super analog design and features up to 75 dB of gain along with the usual complement of 48 volt phantom power, phase reverse and a 20 dB pad. The super analog design really lets you hear your source signal without undue coloration and if you have a quality microphone and musician the benefits will become apparent. The line input offers up to 20 dB of attenuation and you can flip between mic and line inputs either on a channel by channel basis or globally via the console centre section. There is also a third input on the 924 channel strip, an instrument DI which allows for high impedance sources such as electric guitars. The next part of the channel features the continuously variable high pass filter, ideal for cleaning up your recording sources. Then, as you can see, we have the four-band parametric equaliser section. There are actually two flavours of SSL EQ on every channel, and the circuit can be switched between the surgical precision of the E series and the musicality of the G series. Between these two, you should be able to accomplish all of your tonal needs. Furthermore, you can see that the high and low shelving EQs can be switched to a bell slope, thus providing even more sonic shaping. The two midbands are of course fully parametric with Q control and offer a wide range of tonality. You can also see within the EQ section a switch for the insert point. An interesting point here is that the send is always active and that the switch merely enables the return. Of course the insert can be moved either pre or post EQ. The AWS also has two assignable channel dynamics processors that are housed in the console center section. They can be inserted onto any channel and can also be placed exactly where you want within the channel signal path, before or after the EQ. After the EQ section, there is a switch labelled Direct Pre EFX. The AWS 924 features a direct output on every channel, and normally it would be sourced after the channel large fader. By engaging this switch, the output is sourced pre the large fader, and through SSL's innovative EFX system, any of the following Q or FX level controls can control that channel's direct out. As previously mentioned, there are two effects and level controls that can access four mono effects buses. The stereo Q control can access one of two Q buses along with its own dedicated stereo panning control. Additionally, the Q send can be sourced pre or post the large fader. Each channel on the 924 can be routed to either or both of the main stereo buses labeled record and mix, all via the dedicated routing switches. The AWS also features eight track buses, which can be accessed and routed from the meter bridge above the channel strip. At the end of the channel is the large clear digital scribble strip display, which can be labelled via the AWS remote browser in the analog domain and automatically picks up track names from the workstation when in DAW control focus mode. The display can also be used when editing DAW functions. And of course, no console channel would be complete without the large, touch-sensitive 100mm motorised fader, which can control either the analogue path or act as a DAW controller.